On day 10, we'll be flying back from Israel. We'll load on the airplane and take off from Tel Aviv about midnight. Because we'll be flying with time this time, we'll have longer to sleep and it'll only take us one day to get back, as opposed to two days to get there. Then the sun starts to come up, and you can especially see it off the east wing as we approach Greenland. You can see here we're flying over seven miles high at over 500 miles an hour, and it's very cold outside. Several start to work on their immigration documents as we come in over Canada headed to America. The pastor came back more holy than when he went. Then it was time to serve breakfast and get ready to land. As we arrive at JFK, it's still kind of dark outside. We'll check when our flight is arriving and then get on the tram and head to the proper terminal. Once we arrive, we'll have a few hour wait and then on to the plane for Atlanta. We we'll leave JFK for Atlanta and fly low over the scenery as we go. After a short flight, it's time to land in Atlanta. Deborah's in a very big hurry to get home. We'll drop Tim here and also sing happy birthday to June. Sing happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, God. Happy birthday to you. We'll head through the terminal, take the escalator down to the subway area, jump on the subway, and then take off back down the terminal to our destination. Deborah always moving fast. She's ready to get home. Then on to our airplane, push back from the gate. Taxi out and take off. We're now on the last leg of our trip headed to Jackson, Mississippi. We'll arrive in the early afternoon. Then back on the ground in Jackson, Mississippi. Taxi to the airport. And then take off. Andy's ready to see mom and dad. Andy finds mom and dad waiting. And June finds Lexi's brought a whole bunch of people with her too. Then it's time for our group to say goodbye to each other, get our luggage, 
and end the trip.